Welcome to my channel. If you like my videos, then kindly subscribe, like, and watch. Thank you. Hello, welcome back. Problem 1.20. The statement is a 40 kN axial load is applied to a short wood, wooden post that is supported by concrete footing resting on undisturbed soil. Determine the maximum bearing stress on the concrete footing. B. The size of the footing for which the average bearing stress in the soil is 145 kPa. So you can see this is wood, wooden short wooden post that is supported on this concrete footing and this concrete footing is placed on disturbed soil clear and uh, we have given data that a 40 kilo newton axial load this is compressive load and so this will be p bearing so p bearing is 40 kilo newton this is applied on this wood, wooden post, short wooden post. Rest the dimension of this wooden post is 120 millimeter, 120 millimeter into 100 millimeter. And it is also given that the bearing stress in the soil is, bearing stress of the soil is equal to 145 kilopascal. So what you have to find, first one, in part A, it is given that to find the bearing stress of concrete, the bearing maximum bearing stress on concrete footing. So you have to find this and in B part it is given to find the size of footing. So footing is of size B by B, so it is a square, so we have to find its size B for concrete footing. So let's start with the solution. So we'll start our first part that is about uh, bearing stress on concrete. Bearing stress on concrete footing. As we know that uh, this bearing stress in concrete is equal to force per unit area or bearing stress per unit area and we know that area of this uh, the wooden this wooden piece that is acting on this concrete has an area of 120 by 100 millimeter so we will take this area so area is equal to 120 by 100 millimeter so it will be equal to 1200 12000 clear and uh, if we write it uh, 12000 okay 12000 so it will be millimeter square square millimeter again if you it will be one one more zero okay so it will in term of meter it will be equal to 120 into 10 to the power minus the square meter i hope you have idea about how to convert millimeter square millimeter into square meter so this is the area now we can find the bearing stress in the concrete is equal to PB divided by the area on the concrete so PB is 40 so 40 into 10 raised to power 3 will convert it into mm, Newton divided by the area which is 120 into 10 raised to power minus 3 square meter it is in Newton and it is in meter okay so when you solve this you will get it 3.5 3 into 10 to the power 6 Pascal 6 Pascal again this bearing stress in concrete is equal to 3.33 10 to the power 6 is mega so it will be mega Pascal so this is the answer of our first part that bearing stress 
that concrete is taking due to this load is 3.3 megapascal. Now we will move toward part B size of footing, concrete footing. Okay, that is B. We have to find this B. We have given this uh, bearing load is equal to 40 kilo Newton. Here we have bearing stress as this concrete footing is placed on undisturbed soil having bearing stress 145 kilo Pascal and that will be equal to 145 into 10 to the power 3 Pascal. Okay, so we know that bearing stress of the soil is equal to PB divided by the area. Now, the, what will be the area? Area again will be the, uh, as this concrete footing is placed on this, on the soil, so area will be B by B. So that is equal to PB divided by B multiplied by B, or you can say B square. So from here you will get this B square is equal to P B over sigma B of soil. Okay. So when you put the value 40 into 10 to the power 3 layer and another we have bearing stress of the soil is 145 kilopascal so 145 into 10 to the power 3 so when you solve it it will give you the value of 0 0.27586 square meter so b square is equal to 0 0.27586 let me correct it 27 5, 8, 6. Again, if you take square root on both sides, so B will be equal to square root 0 0.27586. And when you solve it, you will get this B is equal to 0 0.525.5. Five to five meter R in term of millimeter B is equal to five twenty five millimeter. So this is the size of footing that is needed to hold this load. So B is equal to five twenty five millimeter. I hope you have learned and enjoyed this video. Keep watching and supporting me like that. Thank you very much.